a lot of people breathe slay here aka the beauty plug or that connects you to your beautiful and listen while yes this was supposed to be posted on what what's new wednesday i'm posting it today okay and partially because i had to wait for it but listen if you want to find out my thoughts on this new black opium over red listen go get a snack as Wendy Williams say, go get a snack and come on back. Listen, because you're going to want to hear all the tea on this, okay? Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. If you have not subscribed to the channel already, I don't know what you're waiting for. But um, come on now. You know what to do. Okay, y'all. Hello. I am filming this on a late night. All right. I got my little, my little, um, lingerie for y'all and, um, for me, not for y'all, but listen, first and foremost, I have some new deets and treats for y'all. And yes, I haven't, I'm not posting this on a what's new Wednesday, even though this is a what's new Wednesday technically today, but listen, y'all, I had to wait till I got actual bottle shout out to zebra from my local uh, macy's who was like here let me give you a travel a sample size and then hooked me up with a bottle of it and when i say hooked me up she allowed me to get a little pre-sale pre-sale okay so shout out to her um listen let me tell you something when i got the sample of it and what I'm talking about is black opium over red. Okay, here it is right here. When I got the sample of it, or when I smelled it initially in the store, one moment. This is a little travel size that she gave me, and this is a hefty amount, okay? Listen. If Tom Ford's lost cherry and Black Opium Leaf Parfum had a baby. Here it is. Okay. Let me tell you something. Here it is. Now, I bought the small bottle of 50 ml. And I don't know why I did that. Well, I do know why I did it. I have so many fragrances. Like, overwhelmed with so many fragrances. Close to 300 now. 300 now. 300. And I said, you know what? Let me save a little bit of coin. Even though it doesn't make sense, $30 more, $20 more, you get double the size. But listen, I got me a small little bottle. And I hope and pray that this bottle doesn't, I don't eat through this. Because when I tell you, now I'm unboxing this here with you guys. But I already know what it smell like. Okay? Okay. So let's talk about some deets about this fragrance. Now. Black Opium is very well known. Black Opium, the original Black Opium came out maybe 10 years ago, almost 10 years ago. And it was a, it was either a love or hate, okay? It had coffee notes in it. It was, listen, I bought it when it first hit the shelves. In fact, it was a gift from Bay at the time and absolutely loved it, okay? Then a few flankers came out. And then recently, Le Parfum came out, I believe last year or early, yeah, last year came out. And I did a review on that, so go check that out. As soon as it hit the shelf, I got it and brought it to y'all, okay? Love it, okay? If Black Opium, the original, was just a little too, the coffee you just couldn't get with it, and you wanted something sweeter, nice and intense and sweet and just sexy, Le Parfum was for you, okay? Now, this is like Le Parfum with an added note of cherry. So... We gonna open it, okay? Now, this has, and let me give you the notes. It has top notes of cherry, green mandarin, middle notes of orange blossom, jasmine, and black tea, and base notes of Madagascar vanilla, coffee, and Indonesian patchouli. Baby. This is a 50 ml, which is a 1.6 fluid ounce. Let me tell you something. I spent a little coin in this, okay? Okay? I spent a little coin. With tax and everything like that, I believe it came out to 140 something. Okay? And, yeah, I could have waited till Valentine's tell, 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 you know, 
this is what I want for Valentine's. But I didn't want to wait because I wanted to bring it to you guys. Even though I had the sample before that came straight from the original bottle, I wanted to bring out it from here. So I don't know why I went and bought this small bottle. Anyway, this is in the typical black opium bottle. This has, I don't know if you guys can see, a very sexy red tint on it. It is a trans translucent bottle it's not opaque but it's translucent but it's and it's red okay of course typical top now i'm not i'm going to bed after i record this but i'm not spraying this on no paper i'm spraying it on me okay so i'm gonna show you guys the atomizer and let you see Listen. Ooh, now you know it's good when I do that. Brothers, husbands, wives, whomever. Go right now before Valentine's Day. Go on ahead. And Macy's is going to have a sale. They're going to give you 15% off the week before Valentine's Day. They probably have a friends and family sale around that time. Just go ahead and go get you a big bottle of this. Go get it. Go on ahead and go get you, not you, get your boo, get your bae, get whoever. Go run and get them a big bottle of this. When I tell you this is all the things and more, listen to me. For once in my life, I regret getting this small bottle. When I tell you this thing is a sexy red ruby, ruby woo lip, and I don't like blue undertones, red with blue undertones, but this one here, this look like a ruby woo or a deep cherry lip, okay? You got them all black. You may have on red. Let me tell you something. When I tell you from ages, teens up to you, you could be 70, 80. When I tell you this is going to be a very, and this is a very likable fragrance amongst, listen, if you like sweet, but then you're like, oh no, that's too sweet. I can't deal. Or you, you like sweet, and but you don't like too sickingly sweet. You want to touch a gourmand, but you want a little bit a little bit of a juicy cherry. Listen. And then it has Indonesian patchouli. Now, I love patchouli. Do I get any patchouli in this? And let me spray it again. I don't mind if I do. Oh, this spray is, I don't know. It's coming out a little funky. I don't really get patchouli in here. And if patchouli is in here, well, it says clearly then that's good because it'll make the fragrance last. last. The fragrance will definitely... <sighs> I don't know why I did that to myself. I'm going to have to go back and exchange this for a bigger bottle. Listen to me. Go on ahead and get it. Go get it. Now, is this a safe blind buy? If you ask me, yes. If you like... Gourmand, all around gourmand. And the gourmand, people think gourmands are just warm flavored, I mean, warm scented like cakes and like cakes and no. Gourmand includes lemons. Anything that's edible is what gourmand fragrance is. And so the fact that Black Opium took a take on the, ch the cherry note and then took a take on Le Parfum and kind of put the sweetness of the vanilla with this cherry... I'm going to go to bed tonight in love with myself. Mm hmm Yep. Because can't nobody love you like you can. Okay? It's been Bree Slade stamped. Is this a stay or a slay? Baby, this is an ultimate slay. Ain't nobody 
I don't care what black opium flanker you got on. Ain't nobody smelling better than you with this one right here. Nobody. Amazing. Delicious. Amazing. Amazing. Okay? Okay. I'm just telling you, go on ahead and get it. Okay? So, ladies and gentlemen, I've just wanted to come back and say it does not last. It smells delicious, but it does not last. Now, I was going to give you guys a sneak peek of another fragrance that I added to my collection. However, it smell ain't even smelling because I done sprayed this black opium and black opium over red and it don't even touch. I can't even get the smell because this has taken over the whole room. This Father God, we thank you. This is amazing. Go. Go get it. Anyway, I am done here. I had to bring out a quick review. Forgive me for not posting this on Wednesday. I know some of you look forward to Tuesday night, midnight, technically Wednesday, me posting my What's New Wednesday, and I am so sorry, but here it is. I got it to y'all, and go on ahead and go get it. And if you have it already, please post down below your thoughts and what you think and how you feel about it. And if you don't have it and you're planning on going to get it, and this video has convinced you to do so, also, once you get it, please come back and comment and let me know what you think. Please, I'm always interested in hearing what my subscribers think or what the watchers think about my reviews and about fragrances that I suggest. So let me know what you think and also comment and let me know what your sense of the day is. As always, stay elevated, stay humble, stay beautiful, and stay blessed.